Hi everyone, it's a beautiful day. Welcome back to Five Tool Tuesday. Five Tool Tuesday. Today's video is all about tools that you can make yourself for leather work. Stick around to the end of the video where I'll give you a bonus tool. It's definitely worth the wait. The first tool on my list is the maul. Now this is really good for uh, leather stamping, punching holes, anything you need to beat a tool to get it into the leather, to cut the leather, to stamp the leather, anything like that. I put a piece of leather around this with some brass tacks. So the brass tacks won't damage the tool if you accidentally hit the tool with the brass tack um, and it won't split or mar up the, the maul. This one is made uh, from a lathe but you could just as easily carve one out of wood. Maybe we'll do a tutorial about that in the future. Next on my list is, uh, I'm not trying to rhyme these, but the simple awl. Um, a scratch awl is an invaluable tool. When you're working with leather, you can use it to mark your patterns, you can use it to mark holes, you can use it to pick leather bits out of hole punches. There's just so many uses. This one, um, my dad made. My dad made most of these tools. Um, it's just a sharpened piece of metal um, stuck into a handle. Oh, this is a really important one. The stitching pony. You need a stitching pony if you're going to be doing any stitching of leather. So this one, my dad and I made together and uh, in his workshop and it's awesome, I love it. There's lots of tutorials on how to make these online um, on YouTube and it's lasted me for years and years and years. Very simple design, fairly easy to make. Ah uh, yes, the edge slicker or burnishing tool. This is one that I made on a lathe. I also made this one on a lathe. This one has a metal piece stuck in it. I use this on my drill press, so I pop that into the drill press and as it spins you can run the leather along it. You know, I have nice wide grooves up to all the way up to tiny, tiny little grooves. Um, I have a flat spot there. With this one I have this here and I use this a lot when I have three or more plies of leather and I need to burnish that edge. Very, very important tool to have in the workshop and easily made yourself. Number Five. This is just basically a piece of sheepskin stuck to a stick that will give you a wool dauber. And I actually find that this is better than the wool daubers. It leaves a nicer finish. The die is more even and I really like this tool and use it quite a bit. Now the sixth tool that you can make yourself happens to be a little bit more difficult to make yourself, but there are videos out there telling you how to do it. This is a round knife. This is a round knife that my dad made out of a saw blade. This is my main round knife. I use this all the time for everything. This is a tool that replaces five or six tools if you know how to use it correctly. Invaluable tool. It's kind of the symbol of the leatherwork trade. I love this tool. I use it all the time. I have another round knife. A saddle maker friend gave me a thing. You can see it's actually put together with copper rivets. They're both really lovely knives. They're both handmade. Um, this also made from a saw blade. Make sure to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.